They're referring to a rocket, right, and not missile, as in the Catholic prayer book. Well, if the shot of the huge, fiery, non-Catholic prayer book and the non-Catholic prayer book spelling of missile is any tip-off, then yeah. You've heard of Painted Desert? This is Painted Backdrop Desert. They couldn't get Vincent Price, but trust Everything me, this I guy's even better. Build. You'll have to admit that's quite an accomplishment. Absolutely fantastic. Almost looks real. By the way, the sheriff's car is outside. This is back when the government used to come over to your house and give you some good-natured ribbing. Prisoners. Don't touch the fence till I turn off the current. But uh, peeing on it's fine, right? Oh, more than fine. I encourage it. NASA could save a lot of money on spaceships if they just made heavy use of pegboard. One of the prisoners is a pretty shrewd kid. The other one's smart, too smart. Has Rickers left? Yes, he has. John, isn't a drink? I won't let you refuse. We're celebrating. I like a woman who flat out forces me to drink alcohol. I've been up there with a jillion wires. Now, which one's the shrewd one and which one is very well, smart? Stuck, yeah? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Looks like Dirk is going to beat them with a bag of oranges. I want to take this ship up tonight. Up? Up where? To the moon. Alice. First thing I want you fellas to do is to change into clothes you'll find in that locker over there. Slip into something more comfortable, boys. It's going to be a bumpy night. Honey, why can't you have a rocket ship as big as Dirk's? There are a couple of spare face masks. You know, in case we want to play any pickup hockey on the moon. You know, I'm going to try this strategy when I remodel my kitchen. Why should I pay contractors when I could just shanghai a couple of car thieves at gunpoint? Please. That's the beeper telling me it's time to take my Lipitor. How long will this keep up? It's hard to say. Who would have thought my impromptu flight to the moon would be fraught with unexpected problems? There you are. This is a job for a frail old man. Here, grab it. I'd give him a glass of water, but I'm afraid he'd stab it into his own eye. Steve, come here quickly. Quick enough for you? Break one. Hell, break two if you want. I didn't pay for him. Well, somebody's got to say it. The moon is really a letdown. Yeah, hell, I'd rather vacation in Syria. Gad zooks, the papier in this cave looks freshly mached. Go ahead, take your masks off. It's okay. And your pants, if that'll make you feel more comfortable. Ah, I see you've recovered from round one of the probing. Do you like the hat? It's a gift from Elton John. Is it too busy? Alpha was pleased. Alpha? Well, it's short for Albusto Fustafa. It is only Over here. Mm, he's got that traded the ship for magic beans look on his face. I tell you, back in my day, a little knockdown drag out cat fight was the fastest way to break up an inauguration. There's no time to tell the leader. She's in the can. No. You know, in the sequel, the Muppets take a missile to Manhattan. This guy actually rides a bike. I find you. Gervasian. Alpha. Stop plotting hypno murders. I wish to speak. What do you decree now, my Lido? Oh, she should have said, Lee, don't take it personally. Or, uh, speak hands for Lido. Or, what do you decree now, Saka? Lido has was being made ready for you. First time in a chair, Gary? Ah, uh, not the spiders, not the spiders! Ah, ah! This must be it. Come on. Let's hope this is a two-holer. If so, I want some courtesy flushes this time. Good lord, the dancer must get paid by the dancing-induced suicides. First time Gary's ever unchained a woman. Stop the dancing! But it was just getting going. Why are you not searching for the Earthmen? Do you dare defy me? I'm on break. Dayton, you are free. <laughs> All right with you broads if I keep this robe? Where am I? Why do I feel groovy? We gotta keep moving. We gotta find our suits. Oh, yeah, we got them back in the tunnel. Good. Where's Gary? He said he'd meet us later. The most casual escape from the moon ever. And it will be your hand that destroys the Earth people. Unless you want to do it with your butt cheek. Amanda. Quickly, someone go out and get a 3M window sealant kit. Dwayne Johnson. Oh, that's the rock man, not, you know. Yes. Look, lady, stop padding your part and just die. Go to hell! Before we start, there's just one thing. Yes, June? Why are your pants all blue? 
And hey, that's it for us. I'd like to thank my guest, the funniest man in America, Mr. Fred Willard. It was quite a trip, Mike. I, I thank you for joining me on it, and we'll see you right here next time at RiffTracks.com. RiffTracks. Some movies have it coming.